Hello everyone, in this video you are going to learn how to install Kali Linux in VirtualBox. So, the first step is you have to open the uh, your browser and search for virtualbox.org. Go to downloads. From here download the Windows host. Followed by that you have to go to Kali.org. Click on download, click on virtual machine. If your system is 64 bit, go ahead and download the uh, Call Linux for VirtualBox 64 bit. However, if it is 32 bit version, go ahead and choose 32 and download it on your system. In my case, I am going to download the VirtualBox 64 bit version. I have already downloaded them. All I have to do is just simply launch the installation. So, go ahead and install VirtualBox on your system. The moment the installation completes, go ahead and close the installation window. Followed by that, you have to go ahead and extract the Kali Linux that you have downloaded. Now, for instruction, you will need to install WinRAR 7-zip or you can always use the default Windows extractor file. In my case, I will be using WinRAR. So right click and choose extract here. After the extraction completes, you have to simply open the virtual box by searching it on the taskbar. I'll make it full screen and now go to file, sorry, go to machine and choose add. From here, locate the Kali Linux where you extracted that. In my case, I have extracted that in desktop. Open. So and now you can see that Kali Linux has been imported into the virtual box and now you can see the settings regarding the graphics card, the other settings related to IDE, the audio driver, the USB and other stuff. And most importantly, here you will see that username and password of this operating system. By default, it is Kali and Kali. So for now to start it, just simply click on start and wait until it boots the operating system. Okay, Kali Linux has now boot, boot it inside the virtual machine. So go ahead and enter your password. If you wish to make the uh, make it full screen, go to view and now choose full screen. Please be in mind that if you want to simply get out of the full screen, you have to just simply right and then press the uh, right control on your keyboard. So for now you can see everything is good to go, now you can just simply go ahead and enjoy using Kali Linux in a virtual environment in your Windows 11 machine. I have always this habit of uh, updating the shell inside the Kali Linux. So for instance, so now right now it is going to update the Kali Linux. So I hope this video helps you a lot with getting started Kali Linux in a virtual machine. 